Well, hey everybody, welcome back to, uh, actually it's about four days after the first part of this video, we filmed about the old Studebaker truck. Uh, we're gonna convert these lights. We, we ripped the old system I had out of there the other day. And today we're gonna convert these lights. Uh, we, we got some of the parts we need, not everything right now. I'm still waiting on a couple things, but we're gonna try to convert these lights over to 12 volt LED. Uh, it's just a show truck. Uh, it's part of our landscaping here. And I don't know what you wanna call that, yard art, yard truck. And, and guests uh, take pictures and stuff by this old Studebaker. Um, but we're gonna try to convert these lights. We had a, a lighting system rigged up, but it just wasn't, it had uh, gone into disrepair and it needed to be redone. So we're gonna work on what we can here today. And uh, when we get the rest of the parts, we'll finally finish this up. But uh, hang with us and watch. Well, first what we did, we took the, uh, the old sealed beam headlamp out, which had this style lamp in it. And we cut, there's like a rubber seal around here. We cut that rubber seal, took this old style headlamp out. We're gonna put this LED headlamp. I had these bulbs from another project. Uh, I had to buy the sockets and we're still waiting on one more piece. But we're gonna put this in here for now, like so. Actually, there's a little lip there. I may need a, like a needle nose pliers and then there's a screw that goes in. I don't know if you can see that there. There's a screw that goes in there. These bulbs are a little style, so both different style. So both of these leads are gonna be the positive leads, and then the ground will be through the casing. This is 12 volt, uh, but I'm gonna bend that up. We're gonna put a screw with a lead for the negative side on here, and uh, let me get a, get a pliers and we'll do that. So we're gonna cut about a six inch wire lead here. Six or eight inch wire lead, that'll be our negative terminal. Crimp that on there. There's the crimper. There, so we got a nice firm lead on there. All right, so we're gonna bend that little tab up. Let that sit there. We're gonna take our screw that goes in there. Right here, it's really a small screw. I'm gonna put that terminal with the wire lead over that. And like so. that in there like so. Those old fingers uh, don't work so good anymore with these tiny parts. I should be having one of the boys do this instead of me. So there, we converted a an old six volt, an old six volt sealed beam headlamp into a LED lamp. If you can see that inside of there, see that LED bulb in there. Uh, we're gonna take and seal this. I'll seal all that up with silicone and then get it back in the fixture and uh, we'll go from there. Let's take the other one apart quick. You know, I've been bragging in the recent videos how warm it had been too. Uh, you know, how unusually it warm it had been for this time of year. Well, that changed today. Um, Tuesday, today is Saturday, Tuesday it's supposed to get down to around zero at night. So I probably won't be working on too many outdoor projects when it gets down to zero, but we'll see. As long as it's not windy, zero isn't too bad to work in. Uh, today there's a little breeze, so that keeps it kind of chilly, but let's take this other headlight apart and we'll go from there. Gotta take this bezel 
I believe that's what they call this part, the ring around the outside. Um, it's called a bezel, I believe. We'll take that off. There's another ring. I guess there's a second bezel. We need a flat weighted screwdriver for that one. That one may not come. We may be cutting that one. I got the other piece of that bezel should be loose now. There. Came off. I'll set that over here. Take this light out of here. Unplug the old lamp. See how that looked before I cut it all apart. So we'll do the same thing here. We'll cut this rubber. It's kind of a hard, hard rubber kind of piece back here. We'll cut all that off and Put an LED bulb in here too. There, just like that. Got that out, there's the old bulb, six volt bulb. We don't need that anymore. We'll rig up the same deal we did for that other 12 volt bulb. Got the ring terminal on there. Put the crimper on. Hopefully this way works right. There, that one worked. Okay, now we'll put that, there's our bulb with LED, put that ring terminal here. Probably gotta bend that tab like we did on the other one. There. LED is in there on the other one. So we've got our positive terminals. This will end up being our negative terminal, and these will both be positives the way these bulbs are different style compared to what that housing is, but it, it, it's going to work, trust me. Uh, so there, we got an LED light in there. I'm waiting on one part. We'll silicone these up, and then I'll show the rest of this project later. Thanks for watching. Uh, remember to subscribe, like. Uh, Tommy, do a good job editing. Thanks. See you later. Bye.